As Afghanistan's new government begins to rebuild their country, there are those here in the U.S. with ties to the war-torn nation trying to help in any way they can. That's right. Samira Atash immigrated to America as a young girl, and now she's taking the success she's gained as a fashion designer to lend a hand to her troubled homeland. In New York, Samira hopes in the future to do business in Afghanistan. This was to give you an idea of the look, but I'm going to tell you what fabric is going to have. With their former homeland in America's crosshairs, Afghan Americans, many of whom came to the United States as refugees themselves, felt caught in the middle. Samira's sketches depict the decline of women in Afghanistan. She transformed the suffocating fabric of a burqa into Western chic. I felt like designing that represented freedom. We are the same. I mean, we're all human beings. Trying to make sense of September 11th, and for Afghans, 23 years of war. Lights, can you see the bombs? Forget about it, I'm sick of hearing about Afghanistan, okay? Everything's been destroyed, there's no more electricity there. So what? So what? So what? I'll go there and I'll light the whole country with candles and I'll turn on the skies and I'll bring down the real stars. Come on, let's go. Don't be afraid. Where to? Where to? Do you know how the Russian soldier, Lilo, he's not there anymore. He's not going to hurt me anymore. Come on. Don't be afraid.